So vacuum pumps, everybody knows this name, Robin Air, but that's the Chinese Robin Air, not our old Robin Airs that we used to get made in America. So here's the field piece, and you can see I got it down to 29 microns and falling. So what do we get on the other one? Let's find out. Let's put down that. Now this is only this is only about a year and a half old. I remember when they got this. They ordered this, and it's not old at all. And as you can see, there's oil in it, and it's full. Now my father had a Robin Air pump that he used when he was a young man. And I learned on my father's Robin Air pump and my two younger brothers learned on my father's Robin Air pump. So you can see here, we got it on. It's still at high pot. That means it hasn't even hit 29. Nevertheless, try to get a deep vacuum. So about a year and a half old and it's barely used. He doesn't do too many air conditionings here and it's already a dead duck. And uh, let's see, Robin Air Spax, it's a two stage too. Three CFM, manufactured in China. And uh, that's the quality of Robin Air. These are actually $35 in China when you go into the uh, export marketplace and you're looking to import tools by the container load. Uh, vacuum pumps don't cost no more than 35 bucks and then they'd slap the company's name on them and ship them to whatever country they're in with somebody's name on them they'll change the colors for you they'll put a different label on you they'll do some cosmetics but it's all the same setup and they just slap a couple hundred dollars extra on the price when they bring it to the America and sell it to you like this and this is the result and uh, the other result was I remember when he got these gauges about two years ago. They're leaking internally. They don't hold a uh, charge. Just showing me that. So that happens. And uh, it's the difference between something like this that sees a couple thousand uses in a year, something like this that hasn't even probably seen a hundred in a year and a half. You pay for what you get.